What's good everybody, welcome to the underground. Before I begin today's video, I just wanted to give a shout out to Screens, lol, thank you so much for commenting. This dude is over 100k subs on YouTube, so watch me get co-signed, I'm f***ing sick. But today we're back with a video about one of the biggest clout chasers in rap. Sadly enough, this dude grew up a few towns over from me, and is unfortunately one of the bigger rappers in recent years to come out of my home state. He snitched, allegedly, got beat up in a hibachi place, signed the soldier boy, he used to walk the halls with his head held down because no one believed in him. This is what happened to Skinny from the Nine. Born in Florida but raised in Somerville, New Jersey, Skinny had a pretty rough upbringing with both parents having run-ins with the law. He started making music in high school, posting his first track to SoundCloud in 2016, and leaning into the autotune melodic sound that had become popular, Skinny's 2017 single Love Blast popped on SoundCloud, now sitting at almost 10 million streams. Love Blast would get him a $5 million deal with Hitco Records, but it wouldn't be long before Skinny would become better known for his antics over his music. In 2018, Skinny would get arrested for kidnapping and aggravated assault over a stolen chain, and was facing up to 30 years in prison, but only got out in 3 months. This along with an arson case caused speculation that Skinny was a snitch, but I can't say anything for sure. Regardless, this would result in Skinny getting jumped at a hibachi place in Somerville, which is pretty funny because I think I've eaten there before. <laughs> Another thing Skinny got clowned on about was his XXL freshman pitch in 2019, where he said stuff like this. I'm shining. You cannot stop a star from shining. Anything you guys throw at me, all the negativity, the blackballing I be trying to do, it's not gonna work. After getting dropped by his label that same year, Skinny's career would take a bit of a dive, and it wouldn't be until the summer of 2021 that Skinny's name would appear again in headlines, as Soldier Boy had signed him to his SODMG label. While this seemed like a God-given second chance to revive his career, Skinny then decided to get into his street fight with YBN Almighty J after challenging him to a boxing match. Where's my other phone? What? Oh! Needless to say, that didn't really help out his reputation. His deal with Soldier Boy didn't last too long after that, and it appears Skinny's now back to being independent, only receiving a few thousand streams on his most recent songs. Do I think Skinny could make a comeback? Most likely not, as the quality of his music has heavily dropped, and he wasn't really anything special in the first place. I think he was just making the right kind of music at the right time, and I think as a rapper, Skinny has already hit his peak. But let me know what you guys think in the comments down below. Remember, I'll shout you out in the next video. Also, thank you guys so much for all the support on the last video. That sh absolutely popped off. Don't forget to like and subscribe with those notifications on. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you next time. Peace.